Del Dot is currently in the design phase of the planned replacement for Bridge 3, 437, Lighthouse Road over the Asawoman Bay. Construction is anticipated to begin in October of 2024. Throughout construction, vehicular and pedestrian traffic will be maintained. The majority of the work will be completed while maintaining two lanes of traffic, with some construction items requiring one lane of traffic to be closed for a short duration. When traffic volumes indicate two-way operations can be maintained by single lane flagging. The first stage of construction will shift traffic to the north side of the existing travel lanes. A temporary barrier will then be installed to protect the traveling public and workers, while a temporary sidewalk is installed extending from the south side of the bridge. During this stage, the south sidewalk and barrier will also be removed from the existing bridge. The parking lot below Papa Grande's restaurant will be used for construction during the first and second stage of construction, and a retaining wall will be installed within Del Dot's right-of-way to avoid impacts to the property. At the end of the first stage of construction, vehicular traffic will be shifted to the south side of the existing bridge and pedestrian traffic will be moved to the temporary sidewalk already installed on the south of the existing bridge. Temporary barriers will again be used to separate the pedestrians from the vehicular traffic and workers from the traveling public. Once traffic has been shifted, approach work will be constructed to support the contractor's access over the water. Using these approaches, removal of a portion on the north side of the existing bridge will begin sequentially, along with installation of a temporary trestle used for access and installation of the new bridge substructures. This process will continue from both approaches until construction reaches the existing navigation span. Navigation traffic will be maintained at most times throughout construction as work will be completed from the trestle. At this point, the new superstructure girders can be erected and construction moves back toward the approaches while removing trestle and installing girders. A temporary sidewalk will also be installed on the north side of the bridge. Once all girders are set, final work for completion of the bridge can be completed, including installation of the barrier, closure pours for the girders, and approach work which is anticipated to occur by May of 2025. During the summer months, two lanes of traffic and one sidewalk will be maintained at all times, and no impacts to adjacent properties are anticipated. During this time, utility relocations and some minor construction efforts may be completed in preparation for the next stage of construction. Stage 3 is anticipated to begin in October of 2025, when traffic will be shifted to the constructed portion of the new bridge, and pedestrian traffic will be shifted to the temporary sidewalk on the north side of the bridge. At this point, construction on the south side of the existing bridge will begin with construction of approach slopes on both sides of the bridge. Construction will be completed similar to Stage 2 where a trestle will be used to remove existing structure and install new substructures as construction extends to the navigation channel. Construction then moves back towards the abutment as trestle is removed and new girders are installed. Once all girders are set, the remaining items can be completed including closure pours for the girders, installation of sidewalk and railing and approach work. At the end of Stage 3, traffic will be shifted to the south side of the new bridge, allowing the permanent sidewalk to be installed on the north side, temporary sidewalk to be removed, and the final overlay to be placed on the bridge before shifting traffic to the final lane configuration. Construction is anticipated to be complete by the end of May 2026.